I am ready to listen to George. Papa Top. He's okay. certainly having a uh, woo. Uh, thank you, Alan, but this is wrong. People show. love him before he's even sung. We're going to do this one all the way through. Long intro. I've had choices. Since the day that I was born, there were voices. Mm, this sounds like a wise that told song. Me right from wrong. If I had to listen, no, I wouldn't be. I want to cry already. Living and dying with the choices I've made. Okay, it's hit me. I think we all can associate with that because his voice sounds like a voice that has lived. His voice isn't, um, I don't want to, this sounds rude, but it's not rude. It's not perfect in that it's, you know, it's not Whitney Houston. That's okay at this point. It sounds like a voice uh, that has aged, that has lived, and that is what's required for this song. That's part of country music, I think, as well. And, you know, I feel like you can hear that he hasn't always made the best choices in his life, but it's brought him to where he is. It's brought him to the wisdom that he now has. And um, it doesn't mean that we should try and continue to make bad choices because uh, that's not what he's saying, but we should forgive ourselves, our past selves for those choices. And that's, whew, that's tough, I think. <laughs> I've been musing on that recently. By an early age, I found I like drinking. It's honest. Oh, I never turned it down. There were loved ones. But I turned them all away. Now I'm living and dying with the choices I've made. I've had choices. It's the day that I was born There were voices That told me right from wrong If I had listened No, I wouldn't be here today Living and dying With the choices I made it's really interesting because he's not doing that much and I think that we sometimes feel like we need to do a lot in order for it to connect with people but he is just saying it honestly and that looks like his natural way of expression and that's why it hits really hard because it's authentic to how he how he naturally communicates he's just being like this is what I've done and that honesty is like that hits you it's like um you know, taking responsibility for our actions is hard and he's doing it right there in song. And um, that is a lesson for us all. And I think that it is so brave for him to be able to do that and so healing for him and so healing for others. Um, now, if I'm going into vocal coach world, uh, his diction is fantastic. So you can hear every single word, which is really, really important in a song like this because we want to hear what he is talking about singing about is expressive by, while being understated beautiful fiddle as well I guess I'm paying for the things that I have done if I could go back oh Lord knows I'd run but I'm still losing this game of life I play, living and dying with the choices I've made. You know, it's so interesting. I talk about this a lot, but our voices are an expression of who we are and uh, the things that we've lived through and the inconsistencies in his voice are... It's the truth, right? That's why, again, it's touching. It is... Uh, it is who he is, 
you can hear that his voice has been abused a little bit but that's also what makes this song you know i am a person who hasn't dealt with i feel like my voice therefore it doesn't sound like that you know but his voice yeah it sounds like someone who's gone through some stuff and yet yeah, he has a sweetness and clarity uh, and I guess that's him that's maybe the underlying him an honesty and uh, often you know he, he's it's still a sweetness to his voice that could have been lost he hasn't lost it I've had choices since the day that I was born and there were voices that told me right from wrong if I had to listen no I wouldn't be here today live and die with the choices I've made Living and dying with the choices I've made. Yeah, beautiful. Hmm. I think this is what country music is about. Emotional honesty. Owning your choices. Owning your responsibility and moving forward. And moving forward with humility. I would have loved to hear what he had to say about this song and what his experiences were. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please do like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. And I've put a little link to the Country Music Association's channel up here so you can go and check out some interviews with other artists and what people thought about. Thank you for watching. I hope you liked. If you did, please do like and subscribe. And I've put a little link to the Country Music Association's YouTube channel here. I would definitely check it out. It's totally fascinating. See you in the next one. Bye.